Namaste children, I am your Gayatri Mamta Ji. Today we are going to learn about these. Okay, before we start with that, shall you all recite a rhyme? Come on children, you have to repeat after me. Ai Diwali, Ai Diwali Re. Ai Diwali, Ai Diwali, Ai Diwali Re. दीप जलाओ खुशी मनाओ आई दिवाली रे दीप जलाओ खुशी मनाओ आई दिवाली रे दिवाली आई मस्ती छाई दिवाली आई मस्ती छाई धूम धड़ाका छोड़ा पटाका धूम धड़ाका छोड़ा पटाका जले भी लड्डू खाए गुड्डू जले भी लड्डू खाएगा गुड्डू मेले जाएंगे मेले जाएंगे मौज मनाएंगे मौज मनाएंगे आई दिवाली आई दिवाली रे आई दिवाली आई दिवाली आई दिवाली रे ओके आई होप यू लाइक द राइम नाउ It's time for us to start with the concept. What is this children? T H E S E. These. T H E S E. These. Now when do we use these? Shall we see this with a small activity? Come on children. Now children you can see here Mataji has made a small teaching aid now what is written here first t h i s this you all are clear with when do we use this we use this when the object is only one in number and when the object is near to us when do we use these we use these when the object is more than one number can you see here there are more than one books 1 2 3 that is more than one isn't it and here the object should be near to us that is when we use these now this is a book and here we say it as these are books because we have more than one object and the object is near to us next one what is this this is a hat how many hats are there there is only one hat so we use this and what are these now these are hats because we have more than one hat so these are hats again the object should be near to us next what is this this is a pen how many pens can we see there is only one pen so we are using this and what are this these are pens we have more than one pen see 1 2 3 4 5 it is more than one isn't it so we use these here t h e s e these these are pens moving to the last one what is this this is a flower it is only one in number and what is the what are these and what are these these are flowers we have more than one flower so we use t h e s e these i hope you are clear with this concept children we use this when there is only one object and it is near to us we use these when there is 
more than one number when the object is more than one number we use these here it should be near to us that is when we use these i hope you are clear with these now lavanya mata ji will take over the session i'll see you in the next session till then ram ram children namaste children so gayatri mata ji explained you how we are going to use this and these what are the differences also we use these when the objects are very near to you and more than one in number right okay children so open page number 98 and let us complete the page number 98 okay yeah so first you all know that you have to write the date right so what is the date it is 10 3 21 right yes what you will do before writing you have to read the heading isn't it so first let's read the heading children c o m com P L E T E complete complete T H E T E S E N S E N T E N T E N C E S S E S S E N T E N C E S B Y B Y U S I N G using T H E S E this complete the sentences by using these so there are few sentences in your book we have to complete those sentences by using these right so observe the first picture children how many books are there you have more than one right so when we have more than one and it is near to you we are going to use what yes we are going to use these shall we write the same children yes there is a blank given in your book so you are going to write t h e s e these fine write along with me children fine so t capital letter t h e s e these e r e r b o o k s books these are books fine so the books are very near to you and it is more than one so we are going to use these or books fine observe the second picture children what is given in the second picture they have given hats fine it is also more than one so we will be writing these fine in your textbook also you have there is a blank so we are going to fill using these So what are we going to write here? We are going to write these five. Shall we write, children? Yes. T, capital letter T, H, E, S, E. These. T, H, E, S, yes, E. These. A, R, E, R. H A T S hats. These are hats. Fine. So now moving on to the third sentence. Observe the picture, children. We have few pens, right? More than one. So again, we are going to use what? Yes. By this time, you know what are you going to use there? It is. these right 
Yes. Shall we write children? P H E Yes E These A R E R P E N S Pens Fine? So, what is the next sentence children? You can observe there are few flowers, right? It is near also. So, what are we going to use now? We are going to use again these. Fine? Are you all ready children? Shall we write? Yes. Capital letter P H E Yes E these T H E S E these these A R E R F L O W E R S flowers flower sound words right flowers flowers these are flowers right so going to the next sentence what is given in the picture children there are few dogs fine yes now it's near fine it is more than one also so again what are we going to write we are going to write these these are dogs right yes now shall we write once again yes p capital letter t h E, yes, E, these, T, H, E, S, E, these, these, A, R, E, R, D, O, G, S, dogs, dog, ox, dogs, right? Children, hope you all completed page number 98 and understood how to use these. Right? In sentences. Fine children. It's time for learning a home activity. Right? Yes. Today we have a different type of home activity. I know you, you all would like to do that. Fine? Yes. See, what is coming nearby? There is a festival. What is that? It is Shivaratri. Right? So, your home activity is you are going to visit Shiva temple. Fine. What are you going to do on Shivaratri day children? You are going to do Upavasa. Right. You do fasting <coughs> on Shivaratri. And you visit Shiva temple. And pray to Lord Shiva. Right. We do four Jama Puja. That is four times Puja will be done for Shiva. It is early morning, afternoon, evening and again night. We even do Jagarane on that day. Right children? Hope you all visit Shiva temple and you chant Shiva shloka also. Right children? Now I will teach you a small Shiva shloka. Fine? Are you all ready children? All of you sit straight, join your hands and let's learn a shloka on Shiva. Right? It is also called as Lingastakam. We will just learn four lines. Fine children? Yes. Brahma Murari Surachita Lingam Repeat after me children. Brahma Murari Surachita Lingam Nirmala Bhashita Shobita Lingam Nirmala Bhashita Shobita Lingam Janma Jadukka Vinashaka Lingam Janma Jadukka Tat pranamami 
सदाशिवलिंगम तत्णमा Sadashivalingam. Children, hope you all learn this shloka and you can tell in front of God. Okay.